Hey guys, this is Youth Dragon. Welcome back to another episode of Bloons TD Battles Mobile. And uh, today, quick channel update, some quick gameplay from 3.9. Here's the patch notes if you want to take a look at it. Pretty sure if you're, you shouldn't be really looking at my channel if you want to in-depth patch rundown. Uh, just general things, there's new map Zen Garden and Hot Tubs updated to be like the Flash version. Um, power cards. I'm kind of rage quitting card battles because <laughs> it's too much grind work. Like this week it's like 20 wins and I don't have time to just go ahead and do that. So I'll probably mostly be playing classic battles now. Um, there's a fast cooldown ZOMG send. Round 24, um, map blah 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 blah, bug fixes, not anything special there. Here's some really weird nerfs here, like triple darts got more expensive, ground zero got more expensive, sabo got ex more expensive, sniper got a lot cheaper and a lot for a lot of upgrades. Still not exactly viable, but even cheaper lead popping power if you get as your bonus tower. Monkey Apprentice, don't know why they would do that. That just encourages noobs to use it more. Blue and Chipper, super vac costs increased 13k, so that means basically harder to stall out. Mortar, uh, they really just need to fix the explosion size now to be more like the flash version. And then maybe that would be viable. Combo detection, except for the fact you can only have th select three of your four towers, so I don't know about that, but uh, this is going to be some quick Moab Pit gameplay here. I just played the guy who consistently gets on the top of the leaderboards. Played twice, lost twice, uh, first time. Um, I was playing like an idiot and the second time. Um, I, it was on, whatchamacallit, Yellow Brick Road, and I took it late game, and I was playing farms, he was playing with Eco, and I did the fast kill, fast cooldown Zoo MG rush, and he easily defended it, because he was spamming ground zero, uh, so I didn't have any chance there. If you can do that, then you're basically golden, um, but if you can't, then you're screwed. Uh, I'm just picking a random loadout. I'm gonna go skip this as long as he, if he gets, if he readies up, no, he's gonna skip it for me. Thank you very much. Cards. We'll go ahead and try it out. Um, I'm not really frustrated. I'm kind of frustrated with the lack of meta, but I'm not good enough with the meta strategies yet. So I still have things to do. <laughs> Gotta learn how to rush and especially defend rushes. I'm terrible at those. That kind of thing with farms. I'm decent at it with eco because I, pr I played eco for most of my loons career until I switched to learning how to farm. But yeah, uh, it's gonna be a normal start here. Uh, let's see if I can get the spin. There we go. So if the round stalls to max length, you can get away with. Not buying the one zero upgrade for the farm and just get your dart monkey upgraded. This guy looks like he's going eco, so I'll go ahead and do this. And then looks like he was. No, 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 he's going eco, okay. I played this guy so many times and I always lose to him. <laughs> it's ridiculous how many dumb things I do. Um, I don't say he's safe from pinks because his, uh, Lightning wizard isn't in the middle. So I'll go if he doesn't. Oh, he's probably going to send blues, huh? Well, I'll send some pinks to try it out. Do that. Get this guy up before I start losing a billion lives. I'm not going to bother boosting. I really shouldn't have to. But I might have to. Oh my gosh. Uh, I've been having a really annoying issue lately. I've said this in the comments. A comment I made in one of my previous videos that I just get DC'd from the game when I get like connected and then the medallions go into like the trophy thing. 
I get auto DC'd and then I lose those medallions. It's really dumb. So I and that accounts for a lot of my losses. It's really dumb. Like I said, I'm gonna send some blacks here. He's sending greens, which is smart. He's going all eco here. So I'm starting to lose lives here. That's not good for me. Oh my gosh. Seriously, seriously, yo. Um. So yeah, terrible farm eco. I will say. I'll go ahead and sell you, so I can get you up. Uh, no, no, no. I'm so bad at this. I usually just, I'm too greedy. Well, I try to be greedy, and then it doesn't work out. Let's see if he's going to send a yellow rush here. Ah, uh, whatever. Ripperonies, if he sends a yellow rush, I'll boost that. Right now, he should be safe. Um, I don't really... I could all out rush him on round 13, but the balloon trap, you never know. His placement of the engineer is not very good, but it, it does the most. It'll take up most of the balloons, so I don't really think it's really a great idea for me to deal with that. I'm just going to head and send some leads for eco later on. Um, I'm going to do that now. He's just gonna keep sending leads, man. This guy's crazy. Not still losing lives, so that kind of gives you an idea how terrible my defense is. All right, so that good camera detection. He's got the balloon trap up. It's good for him. Gonna have to take this a little late now because he has that, so it'll be pretty safe. Uh, I wouldn't be surprised if he went for a rush here. Gonna keep farming though. I have a really bad defense right now. <laughs> no joke, terrible defense. This juggernaut spot that I'm using is not very good. I just use it because it's better um, for like rear leads and things than right here. This this juggernaut spot's great except for rear leads. It's terrible for against rear leads. So like for rear leads, I'll have a second juggernaut here on last two. Now the problem with also putting my juggernauts here is that. This latter end of the track does not get <laughs> any good popping power whatsoever. So we'll see if he goes for rush here. He just bought the fire, I mean, dragon's breath. There we go, dragon's breath wizard. So he probably doesn't, he has a respectable eco. I think he might have like 500, 600, maybe 700 if I wasn't paying, since I wasn't really paying attention. He's going Cobra now, which is not a terrible idea on this map, especially. Okay, he's going to Trishning, so I'm going to get up some more Dart Monkeys here for the AI Zebras. Alrighty. See if he's going to balloon adjustment. If he does, I'm going to have to get an ODS and a couple more jugs, maybe two or three more. I'm going to go ahead and risk the biscuit and get this up. Because I'm greedy. Uh, no, no, no. Let's see. I'm going to be sticking around with battles. I'm not going to be quitting it just yet. Because, um... Hmm. Again, misdirection already. That's very expensive, Rio. Yo. Why would you do that? Um, but, yeah, I'm sticking around with battles. I'm going to see how 4.0 turns out. I'm really frustrated with all the dumb things I do, though. I'm still not the world's best player, but... I'm decent enough. I'm learning a lot from the games I play against really good people. Like, don't be greedy <laughs> round 14 and not get up two Juggernauts because they're going to send Regal Leads. And even if you boost, apparently you can't defend. So, this, I need another Dark Monkey for this one. Alrighty. I have absolutely zero clue why he's uh has that misdirection guy. But because of that, I'm not going to send a Moab or anything. This he'll just throw it right back in my face. This misdirection, I mean, this this uh, attrition, though, is going to hurt me a lot later on. So I uh, get these dirt monkeys going. 3 0 farm there. Let's count 3 6 7 8, 9, and then 10. There we go. I probably will be able to afford 
my 4-2 farm by the end of the round. So, I mean my 4-0 farm before the end of the round. So, I won't be con I'm not too concerned about that. I'm on track to be doing what I usually do with farms. There we go. I'm going to add another guy here. These ceramics are nasty on like every map. <laughs> Alrighty. I'm just going to spend it all on defense. I'm not going to risk the biscuit, yo. Oh, I didn't buy the upgrade. Oh, no, 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 no. I just wasted lots of money. <laughs> fail, fail, fail. Just get this all upgraded now so I don't forget. One big thing I do, I do is forget to upgrade things. It's ridiculous. Um, I don't even know what I'm doing now. I could send fast cooldowns to UMGs, actually. Uh, I think first, though, I'm going to get some backup farms so I can quickly sell. So I don't have to sell my big 4-2 farms. Um, now I guess I'm just going to go ahead and actually get ODS to be safe. I'm the safe kind of player when I'm playing noobs. <laughs> Because I'll always lose to something dumb. Uh, I'll go ahead and just get 0-3. It's really not necessarily for me to get 2-3. I mean, it'll help. But I already have 3 jugs. It's good enough. So now I'll just get this and save up money for fast cooldowns the OMGs. There's no way he defends this because he's sending random amounts of eco. <laughs> so you can see how this is really good against the AI balloons. Uh, it's typically why I use this spot for jugs. Here's just an overall good spot for the lines, but it's not exactly that much better. I'll go ahead and get this too. I should really just send the fast code on ZOMGs. <laughs> really should. So I can end the game for you guys. I always do this just like, oh, I'll get one more, just one more, one, just one more. And then that just keeps happening. And good thing I got the ODS. I'll get that too, just because. Because um, that AI, those AI balloons are ridiculous. He's still attritioning me after all this time. He's using balloon adjustment now. So we'll steal if I have to do anything. I think uh, one more jug will guarantee that I'm safe. But yep. Because the ODS will mostly clean everything up. Now I gotta get around 27 defense. Alright. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and layer in my ZOMG rush with the Moab rush. Let's go do this. And that's... We're just gonna go ham. And sell you. Alright, there we go. That's the rush. Because I gotta go defend now. Because I feel like he's going to counter rush. So there's the counter rush. You can easily defend that. <laughs> Easy peasy. And there you go. He's dead. Finally beat this guy. <laughs> They're all this time. So dumb. Uh, I'll go ahead and do one more match. Because I had a very long intro there. Please, no ad. No ad, please. <laughs> Risk the biscuits. Okay, no ad. That's great. Alrighty. Um, so, alright, right into the end of the match. That's great. Let's see if I can get a decent player, but not super good. Okay, that's decent. Um, because <laughs> it's too laggy when I record. Um, good luck. Doo doo doo. Um,. That's not the greatest loadout, but we're going to go with it. I got to get my yellow brick road skills going here. Need to get a lot better at yellow brick road. Not particularly great with farms on this. Surprisingly, you can go eco on this map, and it's pretty good. I wonder about eco versus eco, though. Farms versus eco. Typically, eco will prevail on most maps, so <laughs> don't have much of a chance there. But, yep. You can always pretty much do the this kind of start because by 25 seconds you should get both bananas if you place your first farm quickly enough. So you can get away with that. 
So you can uh, defend a few extra lives versus the round one and let um red, so it's not much of a difference, but it's a difference. And here we're gonna get the slight farm advantage here, very early on. Um, nothing special. Another thing that ha I I t mentioned this earlier, but the disconnection thing, it literally happens when my bars are like three two. Sometimes when they're red, I it's actually a bad connection, but most of the time it's actually um, the game being a troll. I'm gonna go ahead and do this, see if he keeps sending pinks. If he does, he's gonna keep sending pinks. Alrighty. I'll just do this. Even though if he stops sending now, he'll have the farm advantage. Uh, it's fine. Whatever. He has no money right now, so I can just uh, do this. He really does not want to buy that dart monkey. Um, he he had he got a few extra bucks on. It's fine, not a big deal. His wizard, okay, and I don't know if that's his bonus tower. Or his actual Tower of Greatness. I'm gonna go ahead and do this first before I start sending. And here we go, send the blacks. To layer in. That should be enough for me. He's gonna need more dart monkeys or a better wizard. If you want send this, or he's gonna just boost. Good for me, he's all the greedy. <laughs> So now basically if he goes hecka greedy and goes for the 2-0 farm, I will go ahead and rush him with yellows. Cause he just uses boost. I think he's smart enough not to know. Is he? Is he now? I'm just gonna do this. Alrighty, he sold his farm. I have no lead popping power, yo. Oh boy. Oh boy, he's sending yellows. I forgot. People like to counter rush all the time. Go ahead and boost here. Gives me some time for lead popping power because he didn't send anything. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and uh, go ahead and get the juggernaut. These days, I just get up the juggernaut. I don't risk it. Um. See if he sells all his farms, goes for the, the round 13 rush, or teaser rush even. We'll see. Doesn't look like he is, so I'm going to go ahead and keep my farms up. He can defend a lot of de rushes decently. And he has enough farms where he can get fan club up, so I can't all in him. I'm going to play it safe here and just not be greedy with farms. Because uh, I have lost on this map to reroll lead rushes way too much for my liking. I'll go ahead and get this farm though. To be half greedy. Uh, let's see. I almost suspect reroll leads, but I'll be that person that doesn't. It wouldn't be too. If, uh, I think I can get him to last boost, so I'll go ahead and do that. I'll get this farm up and save up. For a quick rush here. Round 16. Oh, he's got Chipper, so now it's going to be Camelhead. Okay. So, who, oh, he's sending Eco. Is he? I don't know. Alright, here we go. Here's the rush. So, Camo Ceramic. Layered in. It's a terrible. <laughs> it's terrible. Is it actually going to get through, though? I see it. I see the Ceramic kind of getting through, and then it didn't. Oh well, defended that okay. Round 18. Moab, is sending a Moab is actually a good idea. He's probably going to send a Moab against me. Haha. <laughs> 
<laughs> I'm gonna be that person that gets the farm. Vale. Is he gonna die? Nope. Liv's best liver. <laughs> I think he has one more boost, unless I'm mistaken. I have a really bad defense right now. Really bad. Speaking of which, I might have to boost here. Nope. That's good. Alright. I'll just boost early, yo. <laughs> He's still sending it. What? <laughs> Hello? Okay, there we go. Early boost there. He's probably going to force me to sell my farm. Which is not going to be great. Alright, gotta sell. Because I can't see what's going on. I'll go ahead and send the Moab here. Alright, got him to use his last boost. Nice. I'm really not going to do very well next round. <laughs> oh boy. Six. I'm just going to boost there. I almost had trouble with boost. Going to six. I'm going to do this now. If he, he, I, I could see him defending this though. Just kidding. <laughs> if he defends this, he's he's really good <laughs> for his bad farming. Ah, da da. And there we go, GG. Um. So, yep, that's pretty much gonna be it for this episode. As always, this is Youth Dragon, and hope to see you guys next time. Maybe. Some more good gameplay. Better gameplay than this. <laughs> Bye.